Hello, in this video, I am going to show you vertical alignment in rows. So we have this little container here, which has these three columns. What I'm going to do is, and you know, this row as well, I'm going to create some style for the row. You could do it on the row class. You could specify a different, you know, you know, particular class. And this is just so you can see what is happening. So here I'm going to put a background. Uh, color of violet and then I'm going to put a height of 500 pixels so let's just see what happens just by doing that so this is what happens columns fill the entire height if you don't actually want to do that what you want to do put a line dash items dash start and that doesn't change anything currently, but what that does is just keeps the you know the height, the original amount that's relative to whatever content and whatever styling has been applied to these particular columns, which is very minimal at the moment. But what this allows me to do is if I put center now, it's aligned in the center. And if I put end, you think you can guess what happens? It aligns at the bottom. So that's the easy way of vertically aligning the column. So anything within this row is aligned accordingly. Okay, so there's actually another way of alignment as well. So if I was to copy and paste this, I'll put a no break line as well. So we've got this right here, but instead of putting align items end there, we actually specify an alignment class on the actual column itself. So this is a line dash self. Let's say if I put start, for example, I'll copy that, paste it here. And for this one and the next one, I'll put center and I'll put end. So what will happen now? So we are manually aligning each column. So, you know, we could do in, in any order we want. So we could have one here, one there, then another one there, another one there, maybe one up here and then one down here. This just means we don't have to align them all up, down or center. We can align just one or two of them. So that's it. That's how you do vertical alignment. All this code will be provided in the GitHub source code repository. The link to that is in the description. If you have any questions, feel free to pop me a message and as usual, I look forward to seeing you in the next video.